Hello, hello Project 2, how are you? I'm very well, thanks. Hello Julio, hello Angel, hello Anton, hello Thalia, how are you? Hello Carla, hello Maria, I'm glad you're all watching. Today it's nearly Easter, so we're going to look at a story in the back of your book and we're going to play a game. So first of all, I need to explain a little bit about the families in this story because there are some new words to learn. So in this story, there are two families. This family here and this family here. So this woman, this is the same woman, this woman here is Helen's mother, but she's also a widow because Helen's father has died. Isn't that very sad? So, because Helen's father has died, her mother remarries and she marries this man and his daughter is called Marukla. So now this mother is a stepmother to Marukla and Marukla is a stepdaughter to the widow, to this woman. So let's have a look. There's Helen and Marukla and they are both pretty. They are both pretty but Marukla is prettier than Helen. So this causes some problems for Marukla and her stepmother doesn't really like her. Okay, right, open your books. Come over here, come and let's read the story. Okay, the story is on page 86 and it's called The Twelve Months. It's a traditional Slav legend. Once upon a time there was a widow. She had a daughter Helen and a stepdaughter Marukla. The widow hated Marukla because she was prettier than her own daughter. Marukla did all the hardest work on their farm and in the house and Helen did nothing. One day in winter Helen said, Marukla, go and pick some flowers. But sister, said Marukla, it's winter, there's snow in the field. Helen and some flowers, said her stepmother, and she pushed Marukla outside. The poor girl was very cold. Then she saw a light on the mountain. You can look at the picture for this. She climbed the mountain and there she found a fire. There were 12 stones around it and 12 ma men sat on the stones. Can I sit next to your fire, please? said Marukla. Yes, child, said one of the oldest men. His beard was as white as snow and he sat on the highest stone. Thank you, said Marukla. We are the 12 months of the year. I am January, said the old man. Why are you here? Marukla told her story. January stood up and said, Brother March. The youngest month stood up and sat on the highest stone. Suddenly the snow melted and flowers grew. Look. Thank you, sir, said Marukla. She picked the flowers and ran home. The next day, Helen said, I want some strawberries, Marukla. Marukla climbed the mountain again. Brother June, said January. An older month this time sat on the highest stone. Suddenly it was summer and there were strawberries in the forest. Where did you get these things? Asked her stepmother later. Marukla told her about the months. The next day, Helen said, Marukla, go and get some apples. No, Helen. We can go. Then we can get lots of things in a month. 
the mother and her daughter climb the mountain. I want some apples, said Helen. The reddest apples in the world. The twelve months said nothing. Come on, September, said the mother. The other months gave Marukla flowers and strawberries. She was more polite than you, said January. I'm better than Marukla, screamed Helen. Give me some apples. January lifted his hand and heavy snow started to fall. Helen and her mother tried to run away, but the snow was deeper and deeper. It was windier and colder, and soon their hands and feet were as cold as ice. Marukla waited and waited, but her sister and stepmother never came back. In the summer, she married a nice young farmer and lived happily ever after. So, what do you think of this story? Do you like it? Let's have a look at the questions. Who are, question number one, who are the 12 men? So, pause the video in your notebooks, right? Who are the 12 men? Like this in your notebooks. Let's write the date and the page and the exercise. And the answer is the 12 men are the 12 months of the year. January, February, March. The 12 men are the 12 months. Question number two. Which ones, which months help Maruka? Again, pause the video. Write your answer. Which months help Marukla? And the answer is March and June and January. They all help Marukla. Question number three, how do they help her? Write your answers. They give her flowers and strawberries. Well done. And last question. Why don't they help Helen? Why don't they help Helen and her stepmother? Look in the text. Marukla is very polite. She says please and thank you. But Helen, because Helen doesn't get any help because she is rude. Helen is rude and she isn't as polite as Marukla. Okay. For your homework, you can write and send me by email. Part 2A. Have a look at the picture and describe the picture. You can write anything you like. You can write, she's wearing a pink dress and a pink hat. You can say, the months are sitting on rocks. Uh, you can say anything you like. Oh, the oldest month, month, January, has got a long white beard. You can use some of the vocabulary to help you in the text and write and tell me what is happening in the picture. Okay, oh, just one minute, time for a quick game. Let's get rid of this and have a look at some Easter vocabulary. So we're going to play bingo. Here's the vocabulary. Oh. Here's the vocabulary. To play bingo, you need to write down three of these words. We've got butterfly, Easter Sunday, which is the, the most special day of Easter. We've got sweets, chocolate, hot cross buns are a special kind of cake that we eat in the UK at Easter. Easter eggs, spring, the season is spring, and a basket. 
sometimes when you collect eggs you put them in a basket so pause the video write down three of these and we'll play bingo i'll call out the bingo so ready have you written down three let's play okay cross them off and i won't hear you but you can shout bingo first of all easter eggs sweets yay butterfly yay spring no hot cross bun basket yay bingo Hi, bingo. bingo well done easter sunday and chocolate very good. Should we play one more game? Turn the back over. Okay, pause the video again. Pause the video. Write down three different words. Are you ready? Oops, where are my Easter eggs? Oh, Easter Sunday twice. Are you ready? Let's play. Chocolate, it's my favourite food. Spring, yay, it's my favourite season. Mm, hot cross buns, very tasty. Easter Sunday, yay, it's a special day. Easter eggs, no? Sweets. Yay! Bingo. Bingo again. Wow, amazing. For you at home, basket. And last of all, butterfly. Well done. Oh, time to say goodbye. Happy Easter, everybody. Have a good holiday. Um, on the screen, I'm going to write a link to Ace4 because there are some games that you can play in Ace4 and there's also a story called The Race that you can watch. So have a look at this and see you soon. Happy Easter! Bye!